knew that I wanted a full study abroad experience and that I wanted to uh, have a, a, an interaction with European culture and specifically uh, come to Copenhagen, but also I study music pretty seriously at my home institution and I really wanted to make sure that I could keep up with that and even enhance that while I was abroad. Um, and so the RDAM program with the IS has been incredible for that in terms of allowing me to be in, in Europe and be in Copenhagen and have this, you know, this study abroad experience that everyone in America wants, um, but also still uh, study something very, very seriously and uh, really cultivate my skills as a musician um, and kind of immerse myself both in Danish culture, but also in uh, the culture of the conservatory and uh, learn to, to be a musician in a new environment like that. It's been really, really awesome. So I think in general, um, the overall attitude and philosophy uh, towards music from the students here is very different from students at most music schools in America. I think in a lot of US schools you see people doing music because they feel like they have to and they feel like they don't have anything else that they can do and so it's practice, practice, practice until it's perfect. And I think sometimes they're just drilling notes and they forget why they're doing it in the first place. And I think here at RDAM, everyone is doing music because they love it so much. And all of the people that I've met here are really, really intelligent in a lot of different fields, but have chosen to do music because it means that much to them and because they're so passionate about it. Um, so that's something that's really, really impressed me is that everybody here really genuinely loves what they're doing. And it's really inspiring to be around. Here, uh, there's a little bit, I think you have to be a little bit more self-directed uh, here. It's, there's all kinds of support and guidance from the faculty and the administration, um, but in general, it's, you're going to get as much out of this program as you put in. Um, so, you know, your teachers aren't going to baby you and, and make sure that you, you know, practice enough every day and they're not going to do the work for you. Um, it's really expected that you will you know, maintain a rigorous practice schedule on your own and that you'll really be committed to this. Um, and then the more you put in, the more effort you show, the more you'll get out of your lessons here and, and from your teachers and everything. Yeah, I've been to a few of the RDAM international club meetings. Um, they're really, really fun. Um, it's nice because there's a really strong international presence at the school. There are obviously a lot of Danish people here. Um, and then also a lot of Scandinavian people, but then there are students from all over Europe and all over the world. Um, so it's nice that the International Club has these meetings where they'll, you know, have all kinds of like cakes and, and food and um, you can just hang out and have a good time and, and meet people. And that's been, I think, the greatest thing about studying here, um, apart from all the academic stuff, is that I had this really, really wonderful uh, circle of friends here from all over the world. Um, that I've met through all the different like social events at the conservatory and um, definitely friends that I intend to keep even after I go back to the U.S.
many things. <laughs> uh, Copenhagen is just an awesome city. It's like, it's a really, really fantastic place. And I think it's really, it's nice because there's this balance between being a real like bustling uh, European city that is very busy and culturally very rich, but also it's, it's a small city. It's cozy and like, it's really, really uh, comfortable here. I'm never like overwhelmed or anything. Um, and so it's so nice to be able to walk down the street and not, you know, it's not like walking through New York City and being kind of like overwhelmed by all the skyscrapers and everything. And it's just very manageable. But then also uh, Copenhagen has so much to offer in terms of the arts. Um, there's just so much support for music here, much more so I think than in the US. So you can go to concerts all the time um, and you can, there are so many museums and there's just, there's so much culture here um, and it's really, really vibrant and really present and I think it's really, really awesome to be around that.